Hi, I'm Jessica Amir for the Finance News Network. Joining me from technology platform and service provider in a box group is Managing Director and CEO, Damien Kay. Hi, Damien, welcome back. Oh, thanks, Jessica. It's good to be here. So first up, you've just announced an exciting win in the Enablement Channel. Just tell us about the Enablement Channel. Yeah, look, the Enablement Channel is uh, one of our three channels to market. Uh, and it is where we enable uh, non-traditional entrants to enter uh, and become and extend their brand and become a telco. For instance, you know, it might be a large grocery chain or something similar wanting to extend their brand and offering telco services to their uh, consumer base. Uh, and in summary, uh, we provide a full service, white label, turnkey solution to make it easy for those large organisations to be able to offer telco services to their customers. And Damien, tell me about the win that you'll be delivering to Telstra's wholesale customers and what it means for the Innerbox group. It means a lot for us. You know, we, we went into this uh, process with Telstra Wholesale uh, over a year ago uh, and we were competing against some domestic uh, and some international um, uh, entrants and, and submissions. Uh, we came out winning uh, and since then we've been working through the solution design uh, and the contract uh, and you know today we're able to announce that win. Uh, what we'll really be doing is providing uh, Telstra Wholesale and in turn their customers, their wholesale customers, uh, basically what we're providing in the market today and they'll be providing that solution as a white label solution uh, for their customers and in turn uh, those consumers in the market. The win was really important for us because it consolidates our position as the only enabler in the market that can provide a full service white label solution to large consumer brands and in this case through Telstra Wholesale uh, in the market today and for us it was important that we maintained uh, that market leading position. And Damien, tell us a little bit more about why these non-traditional players are entering the telco market. Yeah, it's an interesting phenomenon. You know, we've seen it in the UK uh, with Tesco, who's now one of the largest, uh, you know, uh, telco and internet providers in the country. And we're starting to see it here. We're seeing Coles and Woolworths move into, you know, uh, products such as uh, um, uh, insurance and, and credit cards and finance and so forth. And, uh, you know, telecommunications is, is a logical next step for these organisations. You know, it's really Really, uh, the catalyst really has been NBN and also the rise of uh, mobile or the access of mobile to the major carriers. Uh, in Telstra's case, it's uh, the Telstra 4G network. And so that's really exciting. And so what we're starting to see is the, the, the large uh, sort of non-traditional entrants taking advantage of technology changes in the industry today. And Damien, these pretty exciting announcements come on the back of what's been a challenging time. Just tell us how it's all going. Yeah, look, it's going really well. You know, uh, we, we just sort of said recently that, you know, we've made the changes that we needed to make. And right now, you know, we're, we're, we continue the momentum in our indirect channel, our wholesale channel, uh, and in the enablement channel, which, you know, this, this was a really exciting win. Uh, and, you know, we're just really focused on, on driving the business forward now and returning, you know, good returns to shareholders uh, who have been very patient. And, uh, you know, it, it is a really good win. And uh, yes, it's, uh, it is a relief to, uh, uh, start delivering, you know, what the company's been promising for some time. Well, Damien Kay, thank you so much for the update. No, thank you very much.